the Canon EOS R, it's five years old and you just might be itching to buy a new camera. I often think about this and I hear it all over the internet. It's not about the gear, but honestly, it's more about your emotional state and your visceral response to the gear in its natural habitat in the world that you live in. So that being said, let's dive in, revitalize your camera and your emotional state and virtually for no money. Your camera might look old and justifiably so, you've been using it. But just like washing your bed sheets, vacuuming out your car, mowing your lawn, these are all acts that make everything new again. You do wash your bed sheets. So tip number one, give your camera a thorough cleaning. Remove dust and debris from the body, the lens, the sensor by using tools like a blower, a microfiber cloth, and some sensor cleaning tools. This next tip will cost you absolutely nothing. All modern cameras come with a vast selection of shooting modes to choose from. So if you're stuck or primarily shoot on aperture priority, for example, experiment with different shooting modes and creative options offered by your camera. Try shooting in manual mode, or if you don't shoot in aperture priority, try that or explore different picture styles such as monochrome and see everything in black and white. Tip three, try a new lens for your camera. It's gonna make your camera feel super brand new. Now, Pablo, didn't you say this was supposed to be virtually free? Well, it can be free. If you have some photographer friends and you ask nicely, they may let you borrow or you can trade lenses for a week or two and try out a new lens in that fashion. Or shop your own lenses and perhaps you haven't used that nifty 50 in a long time and you might wanna pull it out. It might just make your camera feel brand new again. The idea here is to experiment with different focal lengths, such as ultra wide or telephoto. This will allow you to capture unique perspectives and expand your creative possibilities. Tip number four is to get up close and personal with the world around you. Instead of purchasing a macro lens, try the DIY approach. You can use the reverse lens technique or for under $20, you can buy these macro extension tubes. These are gonna attach to most any camera and lens and create that macro feel that maybe, and perhaps you've never tried before. Now that's macro photography on a budget. This next tip, it's a free one and oh so satisfying and one of my favorite things to do and gets me out of most creative slumps. Extend motion and time, see seconds, minutes and hours in one single photo. That's right my friends, I'm talking about dedicating some time to long exposure photography. Capture ethereal landscapes, smooth flowing water, or light trails at night to create stunning and dreamy images. That is five tips to making the Canon EOS R or any camera feel new again. Now I get it, if you need to purchase a new camera for reasons because the physical nature of your camera does not satisfy you anymore or just is not doing the job, then go out and get that new camera of yours. But if not, if that's not the case, if the camera's really okay, maybe it's just time to try some new things. Now I'm gonna go ahead and get back to washing my bed sheets. Peace.